Hi guys, this is Diana Penty and today I'm going to take you through my beauty essentials that are in this plate for whatever reason. <laughs> um, there's only about 10 of them because I like you know keeping it minimal and uh, whenever I travel also these go with me so uh, there's just literally the essentials. To begin with, uh, moisturizer, the most important part of my regime, uh, morning and night. I use Embroilis, which is a French pharmacy brand. Um, and it's pretty basic, it's uh, you know light and works for all weather types and all skin types. Next comes eye cream. Uh, I have to admit I used to never use eye cream before, but uh, now that I've started shooting a lot and you know having people touch my under eyes every single day, it tends to get a little raw and sensitive. So I've realized that using eye cream every night and sometimes in the morning as well, you know, really helps to moisturize the area and um, make it smooth and, you know, manageable. <laughs> so next in my beauty kit is a concealer, which um, I use all the time because I, so I, I don't really like to go too heavy on my skin with base and you know, stuff like that. So I literally only use a concealer under, under my eyes and anywhere else that I feel like I have a blemish or, you know, just to cover the tiredness of my eyes sometimes, especially if I'm shooting really early in the morning. What I like about this concealer is that, you know, it's a, it's a cream based concealer, but it also comes with a powder to set it. Concealer. Next is this multi-purpose blush. Um, cream based again. So very easy to apply and kind of just blend into you know uh, your skin. I use it as a blush and I also use it as a lip tint, kind of just like this. Just a little hint of color, natural. Next is um, a cream based eyeshadow. I rarely apply eyeshadow, but when I do, and sometimes you know it's really nice to add a little shimmer, especially for the night if you're you know stepping out. So this works really well because it. It's, it's easy to apply, it's in a stick form and it's also um, cream based so you just put a little bit onto your fingers and rub a little bit onto your eyelids and you know, you're good to go. This is my staple, cannot do without. I um, pretty much live in eyeliner and you know, add a little kajal to the bottom of my eyes. That's all the makeup I do usually when stepping out and I prefer brown, like a dark brown to black because I feel like you know, it's just easier especially for the day black maybe at night also you have the option of you know intensifying it uh, depending on the occasion so you can you know use it lightly in the day and if you want to like you know add more definition then you use it slightly darker but i think dark brown is usually better than black and um, you know if i'm if i'm going out at night then i just do a little bit in my i use it as kajal So when I like to intensify my eyes more, I really like the look of kajal underneath my eye but smudged out. So that's where this comes in handy as well. Next on my list is my eyelash color, which again I cannot do without because I have poker straight eyelashes. It's not a good thing. <laughs> Basically, uh, I wake up every morning and my eyelashes are just like straight and so I need some kind of, you know, lift and curl in order to open up my eyes. And I've just recently discovered through my makeup artist, Kritika Gill, who introduced me to Kevin Aquan, uh, which I find is a great eyelash curler because I have really wide eyes. Uh, and I feel that this one gets in all my lashes in one go, including the ones right at the corner. So uh, Kevin Aquan, yay. Followed by mascara, of course, you know, thick, sultry lashes. Um, and well defined. I love this one because of the brush and the you know the bristles on the brush, um, which kind of really help define each lash perfectly. This is my all-in-one product, Australia's Lucas Pawpaw, um, which is great for burns and cuts and you know open wounds and stuff. But I also use it as a lip balm. Uh, I use it if I want a little, add a little gloss on my eyelids. I use it as a highlighter on my cheekbones. So yeah, fully multi-purpose. Finally, this Kate Somerville uh, makeup set, setting spray, which is uh, a new product that I've just tried, but it's absolutely perfect because it not only helps set your makeup once you're finished, but it also keeps you protected if you walk into the sun after that. The ultimate refreshing product. Watch this, if I can get it open. <laughs> 
Ah, that just went into my eyes. Those were my makeup essentials. I hope you found them interesting and there were some tips in there that you can use. For more videos like these, like, share and subscribe to Pink Villa.